Okay, guys, this first match is going to be Pierce versus Nickel Cat. Very weird. Soap versus Greninja? Yeah, oh my. The I've never ninja? seen this matchup before. I mean, not Greninja Soap. Let me like double check. Nickel, this, yeah, this is Nickel Cat versus Pierce, right? Yeah. Making sure the names are right because I don't want to screw you guys up on YouTube. Just make, I know, don't worry, we can swap it because we're beautiful people. All right, all right. So, do you have the names? Yeah. Pierce is unlocked? Yes. Okay, boys. So, this is going to be the first of two. And right now, Looks it like is... Smash By the way, just so you know, um, Nickel Cat? No, 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 okay, I think it's Pierce, who is the choke main. He's the one who took my ass hermit that one time. Really, really good choke player. Yeah. yeah, he's a really good choke player. Okay. So right now, this matchup, I have no experience as why. I just know that Greninja is great at starting combos. Greninja things. <laughs> I love Greninja friend. things. I also know that Pierce, I do okay. believe he's the 15th best person here. So I'm pretty sure that's why they wanted him on the stream first. And Nickel Cat, I've never seen him before. He's probably, like, the fact that they're probably up here means that, you know, he's got to be good at something. I mean, look, he's got, like, either he doesn't know the matchup or Nickel Cat's just really good with Greninja, you know what I mean? Well, Greninja does have the advantage of better frame data than Shulk, so that, that's something. Yeah, that, yeah, that is something that is something that Pierce has to work against, but the thing is, though, Pierce, Ooh, I, I think he's an exclusive, I, I do believe Pierce is an exclusive Shulk man. I, I've never seen him play anyone else. Man, he is catching all these sweet mm -hmm. spot up smashes. Well, I meant because he's oh, in... Oh, nice wow. Counter, but if he was in Smash, that would have yeah, been very silly. He would have killed I would have killed. I promise it would have killed. he's going for Buster, I mean... Oh, wait, well, he's got to build his percent up, you know? Yeah, I know, but I mean... I, I don't understand why he doesn't want to be... Oh! Oh, man. That was... And there goes the first dog. That's very unfortunate. I like how he looks up, looks right, like... Did anyone see that? Yeah, he was, he was pretty good. Right. <laughs> there's an air. He goes for an air to force smash. I would think, you know, an air to jab or... Right? Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, I bet you... All right. Nickel Cat's probably really good Greninja, but then he watched that one video, the, I think it's the My Smash Player oh, video, yeah, yeah, yeah. and he's just like, you know I'm what, like, I, can do I never knew that. He's like, you know what, let me, let me try this out in tournament next week, you know? He's like, yeah, I can do this, I can do this. And so he's just coming in, he's just hunting down. You're oh, looking for something else? Oh, he could have got, I think he could have got the spike off of them, but yeah. I think if he would have went for the second air slash, he would have went to high up. But he's going well, to going smash. smash one because you got to clear out the stock, dude. Look at that. But the thing is, seventy-three percent. It's also a bad for him too because he gets, he gets uh, more knockback as well. I know he can, but at the same time, if he activates it, you know he's feeling confident enough to where he thinks he can get it out. Because whenever I see a Shulk main go smash, they usually try to get like the hardest of reads, and they try to space themselves enough to where they can't get punished if they mess it up. And right now, you see him just switching through everything. Uh -oh. Oh, that was a sexy nice back air to take out the stock. Shield, but... Too bad he has seventy-seven percent extra credit, so he kind of has to bring it back. See him yeah, switching, so he's switching off a shield, he's like, I don't want to be combo food. Exactly. He's going for jump because I guess he knows that he's going to get knocked off the stage. He mm -hmm. wants to cover all Greninja's aerial options, like what he's doing right now. That's basically what, I mean, Shulk's kind of like the master of none, but the jack of all trades, you know what I mean? Exactly. Like, oh. he's good, oh, oh, oh no. the what depressing waterfall. You know, that's almost as depressing as getting caped away, man, I'm not going to lie. Alright, first game goes to Nickel Cat, but what I was going to say? Um, that's errors. Error for the board. That happens, man. You wanna, uh, here. No, actually, don't. Don't touch my computer. Alright, you know what? Um, you, you're on your own. I'm sorry, you gotta find it. Plug it into the Wii U over there. Plug it into our Wii U. Plug it into our setup. But okay. So, oh, oh, looks like he's leaving? He's Absolutely not. He's switching to Samus. I've never seen a Samus before. I've only seen his Shulk. I'm assuming he's doing this because he was getting Smart station, exactly. You know. He's getting pushed too hard by Greninja. He's like, I'm just gonna throw projectiles at him. I'm gonna stay away. I'm gonna stay safe. That's his goal, I'm assuming. But the thing is about Greninja, he does have shell sneak and his water shrinkage of his own. Yeah, I know. But at the same the time, key, the if you think about it for a second, someone just dropped the controller. If you think about it for a second, his projectile Samus's might be able to out prioritize and even go through some of Greninja's projectiles, and I'm assuming that's what he's banking on. If he doesn't know the matchup, or maybe he does know it. Unfortunately, they don't go through his projectiles. Greninja's really? water shirt can actually power through Sims' projectiles besides her charge shot. That's what but I mean, that's probably is, what he's trying to do. The thing is, he just has more distance on Greninja, mm -hmm. all. Also, I think he, what I think he's trying to do is, if you can see, Pierce is running away. And not in a bad way, because yeah, Samus is a zoner. Yeah. So he's trying to space himself out so he can charge her charge shot, so he has that ace in, his, like, the, ace in the hole, basically. For him to basically go like, look, you know, I have this. I'm pressuring you just by having it fully charged. You know, I have it. I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna wait for you to screw up, or I'm just gonna keep it there to let you screw up consistently. And I'm just gonna keep punishing you for it. I'll never use it. I'm just gonna scare you with it. What I'm really liking about this match right now, they're both using tilts to combo into each other or keep them away. Like mm -hmm. Pierce, for instance, is using tilts to keep them away, while Nickel is using tilts for combo setups. Yeah, well, I mean, that's what Greninja is, though. I mean, Greninja is basically a combo video and a half, you know? Yeah, no, but, like, like some <laughs> certain, some Greninja players will use, like, an F smash or a down smash, and then they'll either miss it, but he's using tilts to pressure his opponent, which is really what, well done. 
it's very nice because he, he's basically trying to get it for a setup source conference, you know? Yeah. He's doing it, well, he's also doing it, if you notice, like, if he feels uncomfortable, he throws out a tilt and he's like, okay, look, you need to stay back. I enjoyed that nice patience right there. Mm hmm. Just waiting to see what your opponent does. Really good on Nickel Cat, you know? He's like, alright. Well, the thing oh, is, though, because you never dangerous. know what their option is. From the looks of things, Pierce seems to be changing up a little bit every now and then just to oh, keep no. Nickel Cat on his toes, you know what I mean? Oh, alright. Forward smash, raw forward smash, taking the first dog off of Pierce. Doing a lot better this game. Yeah, it could a lot be, better. It, it could be the character or the stage selection. Could be I, I think it's the stage. I think I think it's mainly the stage. I'm pretty sure if we stayed Shulk, he probably would have been doing a lot better. Just because all he really needed was the space. Yeah, I think it's all he really true. needed. Like when it comes to Greninja, playing against Greninja, all you need is space to deal with him. If you can run away from him, kind of like Sonic. If you can keep yeah. your space, you keep your distance, you'll be fine. And. Uh, that's true. I think that's what he was going for. I just don't think the character counter pick was a great idea because, as you can see, this I'm pretty, pretty sure right I'm pretty sure Nickel Cat kind of just like downloaded him, and now he's just like, all right. Oh, well. that was that was a beautiful like, that was a beautiful bait. Mm -hmm. But the thing was, he just was too close to the ground for the down air to actually connect. Oh my goodness, that's pretty dirty. I'm not gonna lie. See, <laughs> go ahead. He tried to do this for the two Last shenanigans. That was that was beautiful. All right, good stock take. It's just 103 extra credit. But believe it or not, Sam's gonna actually do this. I know, because in full back, rage and and look, and she's a full charge shot. Yeah. It's very scary. Oh, he, oh, he wasted it. He okay. Okay, this is a very scary position. Oh, no, oh, not no, anymore. You never Please. Know, okay, ninja. You <laughs> oh, know, hard read, ninja. but invincibility frames. It's very unfortunate. I think he's looking at the wrong percent here. I mean, the hard read wouldn't have done. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I know, but it would have it would attacked on damage. That's the point. Yeah, I know, but and I'm pretty a, sure. a, down, a down smash would have been a much safer option, faster recovery, and it covers just a lot more. Yeah, I know, but at the same time, you gotta think, he probably, like, he barely throws out the up smash. By the way, the good game, game by Nickel Cat. But I'm pretty sure that Pierce uses up smash as a way to stale out and basically do damage because it does a lot of damage on it. I'm assuming that's what he was going for. Unfortunately, he didn't really help him out that much. Game one, okay. The first game of the stream goes to Nickel Cat. Good game, guys.